Let me tell you one thing. If Vader doesn't find Lucas' murderer, Jack Matt will personally hang him by his balls on a branch. Well, Vader sure gained a lot from the commander's death. What are you trying to say? <sighs> nah, nothing. Only that it was because of Lucas' death that Ada was promoted to commander. But you suspect Ada is involved in Lucas's murder? I suspect that if you eavesdrop, you'll get yourself hurt. Or worse. I don't believe the commander was killed by anyone from the bazaar. Who else would want him dead? Fuck knows. Look at the world. Have enemies. was sinking. These are peacekeeper Wiping out all Follow the PKs. The or you'll be arrested. Woke up sweating like a pig. What's outside these walls don't matter, Pilgrim. Peacekeepers make the rules here. Otherwise, there will be a rebellion. Help us in the investigation. We'll help you with the bandits. I told you already. Nobody in the bazaar had anything to do with Lucas's death. Then why won't you let us search your homes, huh? If everyone is so innocent, then there'd be nothing to hide. Keep your brutes away from our homes, Anderson. So you're hiding, team. Time is running out, Carl. You don't hand over the killer. We'll raise your precious bazaar to the ground. I carry only the cr Frame of the PK crop. Aiden, come on. I'm on the roof next to the metro. And there it is. Strange. How many so notches you got on your belt? No.
Thanks for being a great customer. I got your six. Move on, don't do it. on the roof next to the metro. they want from you. If you'd been there like you said you'd be, I'm... <sighs> oh, oh, I did my best. I didn't know there was anyone else in the tunnel. Lucas's death is a big deal. They love this motherfucker like a father. Ato doesn't have Lucas's charisma. He's gonna have problems. Ader said he might let me through to the center, if I help him. What? What are you supposed to help him with? He wants me to find Lucas's weapon, the Lazarus. Went missing from the crime scene. He believes finding it will help find the killer. The Lazarus, huh? Fancy set of brass knuckles, right? I know a guy who trades stolen goods and other shit he gets from thieves. A fence? Part-time fence, full-time scammer. An artless one, too. He's got half the city after him for debt right now. If anyone in Villador is fool enough to buy a peacekeeper weapon, it would be him. And what's his name? Hubert Carbatos, also known as Half-Ass Hubie. Every day he sets up shop in the nearby windmill and waits for customers. Probably selling booze and weed to the PKs. If you want to find the Lazarus, talk with Hubie. I'll chase down some other leads. 
Okay, let's keep in touch.
This one's worn out. I don't know you're here. You Hubert? No, not me. I'm waiting for Hubie too. So get in line. Got it. You know when I'll be here? Maybe in an hour. Maybe two. You never know with old half assed That said, he's got the best moonshine. So, worth the wait. Uh, nothing to do but wait, I guess. Hey, you Hubert? Who's asking? A customer. I want to buy something. Hey, you're that stranger they wanted to hang, aren't you? Hey, Hubie, you got a special customer. It's that pilgrim from the bazaar. But wait, I just want to buy something. So, that was Hubie, wasn't it? Yep. Apparently had an urgent appointment with another customer. Yeah, sure. Hakon, he's running away. Nah, sounds like you be. Oh, wait a second. I see him. Hassel's running to the northeast. Faster, Aiden. You almost got him. See that GRE building. He's climbing to the roof. Try this, asshole! Nail the fuck. <clears throat> Ready for this? <clears throat> fuck <yeah. clears throat> You're all out. <laughs> 
Stop, Aiden. Find him. Sure, Damien. You need to respect the rules. No. I'm respectful. No one's more respectful than I swear. Just goes to show you. Did they rough you up? A little. The worst thing was they took all the Let's take 
This isn't kosher, Damien. You need to respect the rules. I'm respectful. No one's more respectful than me, I swear. Just goes to show you. No one's Did they rough you up? A little. The worst thing was they took all the equipment.
blockade at the center.
Carlos and his groundbreaking fence. <laughs> Hope he's still waiting at the bazaar. The essence of survival? What are you talking about? Want to find out? 
Just close your eyes. No way. One of you might uh, stab me, for all I know. You bet she would. Oh, stop it, Diane. The essence of survival? What are you talking about? Want to find out? Just close your eyes. What do you perceive? Oh, something stinks. Exactly. The smell. Impulses going straight from the senses to the limbic system, triggering an emotional response. Memories. The well-being of the mind. But, uh, well, that smells like... Well, that smells like shit. What did you expect? What do you think people use as fertilizers around here? Too much information. Sorry. I sure hope you don't mean smelling like shit is the essence of survival. Of course not. I have this really exciting idea for a new fragrance. People are gonna pay a fortune for just a whiff. I called it, turn me on. And it's almost finished. I just need some scraps for the heart note. What do you mean scraps, for a fragrance? Oh yes, metal scraps. Ah, so turn me on will be an aphrodisiac for robots then. <laughs> Good one. You'll find out when it's time, if you bring me some scrap, along with some lavender. In return, maybe I'll let you in on my secret. Nara said she needs lavender for her perfume, too. Hm. Now that makes more sense. Metal scraps. Nara wants them. Oh, I hope this isn't some wild goose chase. Making perfume out of metal? <laughs> Sounds absurd. Here, your, uh, ingredients. Mmm, good. I wish there was more oil on the metal scraps, but... Oh, Naira, can't you just be thankful for what you've got for once? She gives me this shit every day, I swear. Okay. Okay. Voila! It's ready. Here, smell it. <laughs> wow. It smells... It's, oh boy, it's like heaven. What is it? Silly little boy. Too young to know, aren't you? It's new car smell. A, a car? Are you disappointed? The scent of luxury is the bass note, the smell of confidence is the heart note, and the fragrance of risk and adventure is the head note. All you dream about is to turn it on and drive away into the distance. Thanks so much for helping me out. Unlike some people. Here, have this. I rubbed it with Turn Me On. This'll remind you to tune into your sense of smell now and then. <laughs> 